Hi everyone, Steve from Touchfire here. I'm going to show you what it's like to use the Touchfire keyboard for iPad Mini. I'm going to use it to write our next Kickstarter update. So here we've got my iPad Mini with Touchfire keyboard on it, ready to go. Our browser is set to the Kickstarter update page for our project. So we'll start off by writing the title. Now notice that I can rest my fingers on the Touchfire keyboard, feel where all the keys are without accidentally triggering the touchscreen. The F and J keys have little nubbins on them, so I can always feel where those keys are. And now I can just start to write. You'll notice I made a little mistake there, but the autocorrect that, uh, that the iPads have um, just took care of it. Something I really like about, uh, about using the TouchFire keyboard, something that Bluetooth keyboards don't offer. So we'll say hello to everybody. Apologize for the update being a little late. Okay, I'm going to put the video in there. Probably add a few other things about what's going on with production. Now, I also want to show you how the keyboard retracts out of the way when you want to use a full screen. We have a few additional positions besides our standard retraction position. We also have a nice roll down position. Some people just like to flop it over. In any case, it's really quick to get it back. And that's, uh, that's a very quick intro to using the Touch for Our Keyboard for iPad Mini. Thank you very much.